Hello people, how are you? How was Valentine's celebration? Well, we'll do a recap of how your favorite gospel artist got to celebrate February 14th, Valentine's Day. Welcome to Message in the News on The Libid Christian. On every other channel, you get just the news. But right here, you get the news and the message that makes edifitainment. For a jolly ride, please like, subscribe, and turn on the notifications bell. I would be restating the obvious if I had to tell you love is a beautiful thing. It really is because God is love. And this gospel artist got to demonstrate love with their partners. And it's quite a beautiful thing. I'm sure you would love to see it. Who do we start with? Mercy Chinwo, Deborah Polaneche Horton, Judy K, or should we start with GUC? Let me know in the comment section. After my Any Mini Manimo, I chose Deborah Polaneche. Drum rolls. The newlywed daughter of Pastor Paul and Becky and Nature of Junamis Global Church had a simple celebration for their first Valentine's together. You know, they just went out and had a simple night out, a table for two with mild um, decorations, just enough to mark the night. I really didn't expect them to do so much, especially since they just got married. It looks simple, right? How many of you are those kind of people that just like it simple, not so noisy? I think I'm one of them. For easy concept music artist Judy Kay, she also had a rather simple Valentine celebration. Herself and her husband, Anselm Opara, exchanged love notes on social media. For Judy Kay, she wrote, My Everyday Lover, and she copied Anselm Opara, saying, My boom boom, thank you for my gift too. Well, we didn't get a chance to see what the gift was, but whatever it is, as long as it is exchanged in the heart of love, it is worth it. Then for the husband, he wrote a rather lengthy one. He said, to my girlfriend, happy Valentine and more, official Judy K. I love you to the moon, back and beyond. Chest to a forever, filled with love and more love. Thank you for being the gift that you are to me. I love you more every day. Happy Valentine's, me and more. Happy Valentine, everyone. Remember to sow seeds of love. So seeds of kindness, so seeds that you would love to reap yourself in good measure. Happy Valentine to you from me and my precious baby girl at Official Judy King. Remember also that the show of love is not restricted to a spouse or a partner. Extend it to your family, friends, acquaintances, colleagues, and so on. Everyone deserves to be loved. Happy Valentine's, everyone. Wow, such a beautiful, classic, and simple thing there. Hey? For soul singer Nikki Lauye and her husband, Soul Snatcher, who is part of Rooftop MC. If you don't know Rooftop MCs, they are a gospel rap group. Um, for her, it was Valentine in bed. Like she woke up to Valentine. Have a look. Oh, I just woke up to this right on the bed. <laughs> Baby, where are you? <laughs> Imagine waking up and seeing this big thing beside you on the bed. That's what my husband did. Oh, happy Valentine's Day, baby. Where are you, babe? Where are you? Yeah, see what you made me wake up to see. <laughs> oh, happy Valentine's Day, baby. <laughs> oh, rose is still a rose. Baby, get you are the flower. For my very special wife with lots of love on Valentine's Day. <laughs> Baby, Nikki, you get lovelier every year. Happy Valentine's Day. My heart was broken and God sent you to me to heal it. Now I wondered how I lived before I knew I needed you to live. From K. Baby. <laughs> this mouse mouse of finished me today. Oh. My love, happy Valentine's Day. Minister GUC got every one of us feeling all forms of mushy when he dazzled his wedding photos again on our timelines. Like, look at this breathtaking photos. God is beautiful. 
guys i don't know if you're still on the waiting list if you're a single please let god choose for you like look at these lines okay just listen to what guc wrote he said thank you for the gift that you are to me my love thank you for always being there thank you for being my absolute peace of mind huh guys peace is important be my absolute peace of mind my love and help meet as jesus tarries we will grow stronger and stronger by god's help love you dearly hon it's 20 days to our anniversary oh my word <laughs> please guys marry peace marry peace of mind it's very important peace of mind is more important than hips peace of mind is more important than big boobs honestly you know, God can give you all of that together in a package. But if he doesn't give you the big boobs and the big hips, if he chooses to give you peace of mind with just, you know, a petite stature, receive it with thanksgiving. Because in years and days and months to come, you will be grateful for the peace that you did not trade for boobs. Hey, and if you have traded peace of mind for boobs and hips and light skin... I pray for you that the Lord grants you the grace, you know, to endure. And I pray that he grants your spouse an encounter for salvation and transformation. Minister Mercy Chingwo and her husband, Pastor Bless, commemorated Valentine's Day with the couple's tag game. Do you know the couple's tag game? Okay, keep listening if you do not know. So they tried asking um, themselves questions about themselves and it was quite funny twice interesting please listen we're ready eat small We have laughed, we have smiled, we have laughed, we have read love notes. And while all of that is good, what is most important is for us to live in love. Because the evidence of knowing God is actually loving. And not just loving your spouse, but loving other people around you. Your neighbors, you know, people you know, people you do not know. Just showing the love of Christ. I want to ask you, how are you going to show the love of Christ today? Thank you again for watching. I trust that you're blessed. If you have not subscribed, why wouldn't you? Please subscribe, like, and turn on the notifications bell. We look forward to seeing you again in the next video. Thank you for your support.